Alrighty. What's going on everyone? This is Game Galaxy Zone. And today I have kind of a special video. Um before we get into everything that I'm gonna say here, I want to give a bit of a backstory of what this video is. So this isn't the first time I've seen this 10 million download campaign. I believe this is the, the one we have. 10 million, right? 12 million. My bad. It's even higher than that. Um, literally, this Saturday, which is in two days, two years ago, exactly, I rolled on the 12 million downloads campaign in JP. I did a single roll, I believe, one or maybe two, and I got my first foreigner servant, Abigail Williams. Okay, Abigail Williams is the second servant in FGO that I really, 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 really wanted. So, I was astonished when I actually got her. Out of all the rolls up to that point, and granted two years ago is when I started JP and NA, um, it was kind of incredible. Now I started JP about a month prior to this video, maybe a little bit less. So um, that was a extremely warm feeling because I was going through a lot at that point in time here at college and just depressed. I wasn't getting sleep. I was super stressed. And that was just a warm feeling to be able to get up that day. I know I was mega busy. I remember it very specifically that I had to, I was up way early in the morning. Much like this video, I'm doing this at 4 a.m. in the morning. I just woke up. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I was up that whole night. Did it at like 7 a.m. right when JP updated at like 5 or 6 that morning. Did a few things and just jumped straight onto that and wanted to do that video. Um, so this is kind of a similar case, except it is not my birthday currently. It is 11.5. It is two days from my birthday. But I don't feel like waiting on this because honestly, there's not much if I do if I wait until Saturday versus if I just do it now. Um, I also don't know if Abigail will be on straight up on Saturday anyway. I mean, I think she would. It's no big deal. Now, here's the kicker in FGONA. So with a little bit of a backstory, there you go. I own Abigail on this account. She's level 100. She is 1680 in terms of HP and 1840 in terms of attack and is almost bond level 9. She is 10 10 10 but she is NP1. This is the first time I'm ever going to be rolling for a servant on a rerun banner essentially for NP2. I've never done this. I am going to be doing this more when Ilya comes out. I'm hoping to get NP3 Ilya. But I'll wait for that banner because that banner falls into line with God knows what else. So. So there isn't really a reason for me to be doing this, and I shouldn't be doing this. But I'm going to do it anyway because I have wanted to get Abigail NP2. So with that said, I'll be doing that. I also need to pick this up. We'll be doing that at some point. Problem is, is that. I'm going to need a lot of wisdom cubes, <laughs> or mana cubes. Uh, I don't know how long this is in here. 87 days, never mind, I've got time. <laughs> but just double checking that. So I shouldn't be doing this because Shikolte is coming out like right around the corner. Um, and then next year I am rolling on so many banners that I am probably going to be breaking myself. But we'll see when that time comes. Um, 
a lot of that stuff isn't starting until like the end of February, so or beginning of February, my bad. So let's take a look here and see. So I want to see when she's on rate up. Is she on rate up on the seventh? No. <laughs> For whatever reason, they don't even have the seventh listed. Actually, from eleven six to eleven eight is Abigail Neza. Got Nezas on right up in here, so I have a chance to get her. I also have a chance to get NP2 uh, Cersei, so. But I'm going to use probably what quartz I have here, and then I don't think I'm gonna do anything extra. I might buy a single quartz pack, but that's it. I don't wanna go too crazy for this because I already have Abigail. The only thing I don't have out of this is Neza. And I don't care for her. I have too many freaking Lancers as it is anyway. So. I'll just go with this. And we'll see what happens. So basically we're just hoping for NP2 Abigail. That's, that's more or less it. If the game wants, game wants to gift me with that. Beautiful. <laughs> Do I see it happening? I don't know. Well, Abigail has been out for a year now, technically. This... in about two weeks, I believe, is when she came out to NA. Actually, no, I think she came out in December. Not real, like, really late, if I'm not mistaken. We'll see what happens. Why do I want her NP2 if you're curious? Just more damage. Mm. I cast her. Okay. Is this going to be Cersei right away? That would be crazy. Sure, I'll take it. That's NP2, I'm pretty sure. So, nice. I had a feeling that was really slow when that servant animation popped up. But, uh, yeah, I'll take that. I'd rather have Cersei's than Neza's, so, not bad. Alright, do a classic five. On a classic 10 pool here. I'm gonna let some of these roll out. Just because I kind of don't want to skip everything. I don't have to skip a ton of these, so. Well, in terms of time, it's 4 a.m. in the morning. I'm not gonna be doing stuff right now. A little more tired than I was expecting. Granted, I haven't been sleeping in days, so that doesn't really help me to say the least. Besides what day it is, I am literally doing the exact same thing I did two years ago. Which is kind of crazy. Lubu. That's a servant I haven't seen in a while. You know what I haven't seen in a hot minute? Well, besides that, I might have limit broken that. I haven't seen, not rainbow, but gold lights in a hot minute. Fuck yes! Whoa! Yes! <laughs> NP2. NP2. This is, this is why I love Abigail. Put her to Maximus Ascensionist, and she rewards me thoroughly. NP2, let's go. That's crazy. Pretty happy on that. Do I go 
For NP3, that is the question. I think I might do maybe one or two more rolls if I get uh, another one back up to back, which would be pretty cool. Do I want to? I think I will, just for the show of this. But there we go. Abigail 2. NP2. That is awesome. That is freaking awesome. I honestly, I had doubts, but I shouldn't have. Um, everything just aligned perfectly for that, so. But NP2 Abigail, nice. All right, I am gonna use, I think I'll do two more multis, just because. I know I have Chicolte and other stuff coming up, but I'll do it just out of curiosity. If I can get NP3 in this, I'll be more than ecstatic. I won't roll any higher than that, though. I'm definitely just gonna be, I'll be super happy. Uh, NB2 is a great must, but NB3 would be absolutely insane. So I will uh, give that a try. Let's do, that was a, a nice classic five to 10 ratio. Let's do another one, I guess, just because why not? I even got a bonus Cersei NP2, so that's cool. Now we're going to do the challenge of NP3. <laughs> and see what happens. I wouldn't be surprised if a lot more people end up with Abigail on their listing after this. Because I don't know how many people were interested in Abigail at launch. I know that there was a couple. But at the same time, there could also be a lot more people that have jumped in now. And might be interested in wanting to get their hands on Abigail. Also, Abigail finally just got a skill upgrade in JP recently, and an event coming up has a lot of foreigners on it. Foreigners and relations to Sakura and BB, and I have no idea why, because it's supposed to be like a singularity, so I'm really curious on that. I'm really curious on that. I'm hoping, if anything, I hope it's something to do with Lavinia and Abigail's story. Cause that would be cool. I expected that to happen over summer, with the way that was all teased, but nothing came out of that. But something is big coming with this upcoming thing, and I'm pretty, I'm pretty excited for it. I'm not gonna lie. I'm pretty excited because it could mean Lavinia finally comes to the game, or it could mean like a new foreigner or someone similar. I don't think we're going to get anything new to Abigail, just because we just got a new form of Abigail. Alrighty, doing a 5 and a 10 summon. See if it goes anything similar. Shooting for that NP3. Alright, we'll train. Ooh, gold lights. I was just saying, I haven't seen it. Can it be Abigail? NP3! Yeah! Wow! This is fucking awesome. I can't believe that. Oh my god. NP3. Okay, I I can be done, honestly. I can be done. That's insane. That's insane. I can't believe that. It is so rare to get back-to-back -back five stars. <laughs> Holy shit. I can't believe that. God. This is why Abigail to me is the greatest servant in the game. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. That's crazy. This is also the first time I'm gonna have like a really high NP uh, level 5 servant. Wow, we're just pushing. 
a really good roll. Holy shit. A lot of CEs right after the fact, but you know what? That's that's fine. I'm okay with that. Look at that roll. Two servants in that roll. And both <laughs> Abigail's back to back. Do I go for NP4? <laughs> Uh, probably not. I don't have enough tickets to do another classic ritual, I guess you could say. I could do one more because I said I was going to do um, back to backs, but I think I'll pass just because I don't see myself getting lucky three times in a row. And uh, also that I will use my last summon ticket. Ooh, almost did it ten times anyway. I will use my last summon ticket. The the last big one. It's servant. Ah, Berserker. That would have been pretty cool too, but anyway, NP3, I'm gonna stop because I've got Shikolte coming up and I also got some other stuff right after the new year, so I definitely need quartz for that and I don't want to try and kill myself too too much just yet. I am blessed for this banner. This banner has been the greatest banner I've ever rolled on, probably in FGO, because that is three times where I have been able to officially roll once on a multi and get a five-star servant. Um, it's incredible. Now, that didn't happen when this banner first came out, but that's okay, because this wasn't the 12 million downloads when JP happened. So I'm really happy that I was actually able to replicate what happened in JP two years ago. Uh, so nice. But yeah, this banner just it has a lot of connections to me, specifically because of what happened back then versus exactly what's happening right now. Except right now, I've been going through a lot more stuff. I'm actually going to be posting this video probably right now i don't even know if i'm gonna edit this so if the audio is quiet if anything is different i apologize guys it's just because i don't have the time to sit down right now and fix it i'm just way too busy and the reason why my audio is typically quiet is because a i'm a very quiet person and b i don't like to talk terribly loud because of the fact that my voice when it does get loud travels really fast and far and through everything so the last thing i want to do is wake up my roommate who after today's experience between the stuff that happened here sucked and i don't want to bother him too much considering it's 4 30 in the morning <laughs> so but uh yeah but that's all i have for that um hopefully you guys have a good luck rolling on this banner if you're looking to roll on this banner or any upcoming banners for that matter uh i know i haven't been doing too much with fgo or anything like that i do have some plans once we get into december which i might i am going to do an announcement of that probably around that time period i'm just way too busy there's a reason i'm up at 4 a.m right now after only sleeping for like four hours because i have projects that need to be finished in 12 days now and I just don't have the time so it's been like that for about a month and I've been going through a bunch of other things as well which I can't really go into but it's just a lot's been going on in my life so that's the reason why nothing has come out but I do have plans for some big big stuff it's just dependent on when that comes out so but thank you all for watching like I said Good luck with you guys. Happy birthday to myself, I guess. <laughs> um, NP3 Abigail, so pretty cool. Anyway, I will see you all in future FGO Gacha whenever that's going to be at this point because, like I said, things are busy. See you guys.